Okay, so good morning guys and welcome back to our Zero to Hero series. Right now we'll be discussing the system inside this co-op dungeons. And you will be able to access this one once you start this side quest. And also once you get access to this co-op dungeons, you will start to have this in your menu. Meaning even you are in a different place, you can just press escape and click this co-op dungeons. So here, uh, there are different dungeons. The first one is something that we can say entry level dungeons and actually our side quest is to do this one. And by doing dungeons, you are going to receive different rewards. And obviously you will get better rewards by doing higher level dungeons. And also here, um, you can see that there is a star here. Players call this one uh, T1 Dungeons. And and this one with two stars, players call this one T2 Dungeons. And the system here is every day you will be receiving 900 dimensional contract tokens. And you will be using these tokens to collect the loot of the boss monsters that you're going to kill. So this one guys, I want you to see. I want you to see this not as a ticket to enter to this dungeon. Instead, this is a ticket to open the treasure and collect the loot of the boss monster you just killed. Well, this kind of system is really good because you can enter dungeons anytime you want. Even you don't have a contract token anymore. I mean, you are just going to help your friends to finish their dungeons. Like you're just going to kill the boss monsters with them and then you're you will not get any loot so you're just there to help it's a cool system right okay so the main tip here for our zero to hero roadmap is if you're not yet level 50 just do this specter abyss once just for the sake of finishing your side quest and then don't collect the treasure here so that you will not spend your token and you can use your token to higher dungeons that's why guys notice that even though we got this side quest early we didn't do this right away instead we focus first on finishing our purple quest again again and again the main reason behind this is we're trying to save a lot of time and also we'll be using our tokens to higher dungeons for better re rewards but anyway let me try to do this one so that you'll see how it works so here uh, once you enter here you're going to choose your role in a party so here you are yeah so you're going to choose are you going to be a tank uh, dps the one who does the damage or or support or healer so right now our role here is obviously dps so we're going to choose dps and based on my experience here the easiest role to have a party is either tank or healer because most of the players here, including me, we like the gameplay of killing and doing a lot of damage. So one benefit of choosing a tank or healer or support character is this one. You're going to get a party easier. So let's just wait for a party right now. And there you go. So we have now a party. Let's do this. So let me show you what's inside here. Okay, so here guys, welcome to the co-op dungeons and in every dungeons here, there will be a different mechanics and I'm sure you're going to learn it by yourself when you try playing um, inside this dungeon. Okay, so now let's just do this. Okay, so the boss monster is dead and now there is a treasure here. So this is where we're going to use the contract token. Again, I want to remind you, my tip for you is don't collect this treasure. Instead, just go out and finish your side quest first. And then if you really want to farm here, try the T1 dungeons, all right? And, and actually guys, we'll be doing this uh, cop dungeons every day with a party to farm for the materials and equipment we need for the progression of our character and speaking of equipment 
the other side that we're going to do is this one guys this one is related to farming your first blue set in this game so this one is important because I'm sure you want to complete your blue gears as soon as possible on the early days of the global server that's what we're going to talk about in the next video